your Facebook business manager, your Facebook ad account, or you can also link your MasterCard, your um, credit card, your Visa card. Okay, I'm going to link my Visa card to my Facebook account. So I'll just go next. Hello family, welcome to the part 3 of our Facebook Ads Made Easy series. Today we're going to look at Facebook Business Manager. Before you can actually start creating ads, you have to make sure your Facebook Business Manager is set up, okay? And you have your ads account created and also you've um, added a payment method. So that's what we're going to look into today. If today is the first time you're coming on Start Our Path, so you know what to do. Please show some love to Kwame Trimisi by clicking on that subscribe button ringing on that notification bell so you do not miss out when I release any good tutorial. Without talking too much, let's get right into it. So before we get into things, um, let me quickly say a big shout out to Mentor Candy. So Mentor Candy is a new platform that connects mentors and mentees. So if you are looking at starting a business this year, go on Mentor Candy and look for someone that has already gone through the process to guide you, okay? The website is Mentor Candy. Dot com. Now, before you can actually um, head on to your Facebook business manager, you have to make sure you have two things ready, okay? One, you have to make sure you have a Facebook account created. And two, you have to make sure you have a Facebook business page created for your business. This is really important. So make sure you already have a Facebook account and I'm pretty sure you already have a Facebook account and two, you've already created a Facebook business page and you've also linked that Facebook business page to your Instagram business page or business account, okay? If you want to learn how to do that, I'm going to leave a link at the top section, just click on it. I've got a tutorial on how you can create a Facebook and Instagram account and link them together. This is really important. If you already have all that set up, then let's get right into the tutorial. So um, you can do this on your phone or you can do this on your desktop. I'm going to show you how to do this on your desktop, okay, because it's a wider screen. Um, just head to business.facebook.com. Um, let me actually share my other screen so we get right into it. Yep, so I'll open a new tab and I'll head to business um dot facebook dot com okay so this is where you have to head to you use the same um login details yeah for your facebook um profile to log into your facebook business um business manager's account okay so as you can see here i already have an account set up okay because i already have a facebook um profile um facebook account and also already have like a facebook business page for my business so when i come to the drop down menu here let me quickly um maximize things so you guys can see okay so today i'm going to use the vip.close account as you can see here to demonstrate things to you so this is basically um facebook now it's called meta so uh, meta business suits okay you'll be able to manage your whole business in the um, facebook business manager when i come to the drop down menu here you can see that i've got multiple um what do you call it um facebook pages and facebook business accounts okay but today i'll just concentrate on the vip dot close because it's a new business now with facebook business um, um manager you'll be able to add people um, that will help you manage your business or when it comes to anything in regards to your business this is where you'll be managing things but today i'm not going to go through the whole interface i'm just going to concentrate on how we can set up our ads um, facebook ads account so to do that i'll go to the drop down menu here and as you can see i've got this certain um icon here so i'll click on the vip dot close one awesome so now that i've clicked on as you can see i've got ads account here and as you can also see here we've got people business assets request more business settings ad accounts billing okay and you can see that i'm the only one assigned here you'll be able to assign more people 
to help you manage your business but i'm not going to get into that yeah so when you go to the ads account here now this is going to show you my um my ads account i already have an ad account that i use to manage most of my um pages business pages on facebook okay but i'm not going to get into that so as you can see when you look at the top here i've got prince kwami and this is my ads account number you can write this number down somewhere and i'll show you where to use it if you want to okay if you want to but i don't want to do this today so i'll quickly go um to the profile picture here then i'll change from my name to vip.clothes okay so i'll change this to vip.clothes because i want to create a whole new ads account for my facebook page now so once i've clicked on there you can just go to business settings let me quickly just select business settings here please follow attentively so business settings awesome so this is the page i want to see okay now when it comes to the ad accounts account we've got pages we've got ad accounts okay and we got other um things here like the payments methods and the rest so i'm going to click on ad accounts boom so as you can see here i do not have any ads accounts for vip.clothes so we have to create one or we have to assign our ads account to if you already have an ads account you can assign vip.clothes to the ads account you already have if that makes sense yeah so we um in this tutorial i'm going to take you through how we can create a whole brand new ad account for your business page so you can go add okay i'm going to um yep i hope you guys can see okay so when we go to ads it gives us three options okay three options so the first one is add an ad account request access to an ad account or create a new ad account so the first one is if you already have an ad an, an ad account you can just link vip.close to the ad account you already have and you will be able to link this by entering the number your ad account number you know the one i showed you previously my seven something something number yeah you just come here click on it and add it we are not going to do that today now the second one is let's say if you are an experienced um facebook digital marketer or a digital agency and you want to run ads for your clients yep you'll be able to request an ad account from a different facebook manager so let's say if kwami chumisi i want to run your facebook ads for you yep i'll uh, have to request for your facebook ad account so i can add it to my own account so i can run your facebook ads for you and the last one is um if you want to create a whole brand new facebook ad account Account and that's what we're going to do so i'm going to click on the create a new ad account awesome so ad account name i'll suggest you use your business name so you don't confuse yourself okay so i'm going to type in okay so i'm going to name it vip doc cloyd's ad account okay now the time zone so depending on where you are i'm going to select accra ghana okay so as you can see we have africa accra okay so i'm going to select that one and the currency will leave it as us dollars okay we'll leave it as us dollars for the currency then we go next okay so um who will this ad accounts be used for okay so we just go um my business vip close select the first one okay and go create any questions pop down below okay and i'll be there to help you out awesome now so if you have multiple people um what do you call it managing your ad account you'll be able to give us the admin or the owner of the business you'll be able to give permissions to whoever does what okay but um i'm just going to go you only have me here just me managing this ad account if you have multiple people all their names are going to be listed here and you'll be able to select who you want to manage this ad account it's just me and i'll go to the bottom one i'll just go full control as you see here so manage ad account i want the full control here i'll just turn that on okay then we go assign Tada! we are done okay so we've been able to create a facebook ad account for our vip.cloids business 
now we have to add a payment method okay so when you run your facebook ads you need to show facebook where to deduct the money from so we're going to go add payment info okay so um make sure you set this properly because you only have to set it once and you will not be able to change it in the future okay so make sure you get this place um this certain right so the country um i'm going to go ghana yep we've got ghana here and you don't have ghana cities okay so we will leave it as us dollars as us dollars for the um the ghana um the currency then for the time zone i'm going to leave it as accra as you see here okay then i'll go next awesome so here you'll be able to add if you have a paypal account you can link your paypal account to your facebook business manager your facebook ad account or you can also link your mastercard your um, credit card your visa card okay i'm going to link my visa card to my facebook account so i'll just go next so i'll select the um, debit or credit card okay then i'll go next so now for the card number i'm going to enter yep so i've got my card here i'll just quickly enter my card details then i'll go save tada so as you can see we've been able to add our card um payment method to our facebook ads account successfully so i'm just going to go done awesome so now we've been able to create our facebook ads accounts vip.close ad account this is going to be our ad id okay as you can see here so in case we want someone else to manage our um, ads for us this is the id we'll have to give to the person so they can link to our facebook um, ads account now so once i've created this um, i'll just go to open in ads manager i'll click on there Tara, and now this will open your facebook ads account okay i'll quickly go through the interface here so when it comes to facebook ads okay so our create button is not working i know why this is we have to confirm our business email i'll show you guys how to do this so in case um the create um the facebook ads button is not working i'll show you how to fix this um um quickly okay we'll come back to that so when it comes to the facebook ads interface this is what you're going to see okay and this is where we'll be running our facebook ads if this makes sense so um facebook ads manager got um three criteria. okay we have the campaign so the campaign is the big boss we have the ad set the ad set is the second boss and we have the ads um when we start creating facebook ads i'm going to explain to you into details what all this means but to simplify things take it as the campaign as an estate as like an estate complex okay and the ad sets as different houses within an estate and the ads are like um different families within every house if that makes sense yeah normally the campaign um you'll be able to set just one objective for your ad so let's say if you want to create an ad to get traffic to your website or you want to create an ad to get leads or you want to create an ad to get engagement or conversions you'll be able to select just one objective for your campaigns when it comes to the ad set um, in one campaign you'll be able to create different ad sets to target different audience and with different budgets so let's say if i'm selling like um, bags in ghana okay and i can create like a campaign to get um what do you call it to get conversions to get let's say to get traffic to my website where i'm selling the bags and in each ad set i'll create maybe targeted audience for just people in accra that are interested in bags another target um ad set for people in kumasi that are um, interested in bags another ad set for people in tamale that are in, um, interested in bags under one campaign if that makes sense and when we come to the ads is the simplest okay you'll be able to create different ads with different videos and different ad descriptions so let's say if i want to create like um, an ad to sell one of my bags i'll create different um, designs as i've already shown you like video designs or images designs i'll create um, different ads 
with different um, ad description, then Facebook will like show all these ads to my audience. And um, as time goes on, they'll see which ads are doing good and they'll promote, they'll optimize that ads more and they'll kill the rest. As we start creating um, Facebook ads, I'm going to explain things into details for you. When you come here to this button here too, we have um, the performance, okay? So you'll be able to see the performance of your ads. As you can see here, you've got a setup, delivery, and the rest. When you come here, you'll be able to see the um, breakdown effect by time, by delivery, by action. As we create the ads, you'll, be, you'll understand what all this stands for. And when it comes to the report, of course, it's going to generate the reports as to how your ads um, performed, okay? So this is basically the interface of Facebook's um, ads. If you want to create Facebook ads, this is the interface you'll be using a lot. And once we start creating ads, everything will make sense to you. Now we have the create button here. Okay. But it seems not to be working. So let's quickly go and fix this. So when you highlight on there, it's going to say verify your business email to continue. Okay. So I'll quickly go to um, business settings here. Let me open that in a new tab. And it's going to open our VIP um, dot close um, Facebook business page for us. Okay, guys. So when you come here, you can see that um, business verification status is on verified. Okay. Yep. But when you come down here, let's fix this first. So as you can see here, where it says my info, it's only got my name, but there's no email attached to it. So what we have to do is just go edit and we have to enter our email. So I'm going to enter our business email. Okay which is info at vip.close.com or you can use your Gmail address if that makes sense. But we've already created this, so I'm going to add that. So info at vip.close.com, confirm the email, info at vip.close.com and I'll just go save. Awesome. So now it's going to say um, we should verify our email. So they are going to send an email to, what do you call it? an email to us so let's quickly just log on okay so i'll quickly log on to my hosting to check the email and as you can see i've received an email from facebook to verify my email so i'll just click on that yep i'll go allow here then i'll go confirm now yay so our email has been verified so now let's head back to our ads account and as you can see now tada we now have the create button here okay so we'll be able to create our ads moving forward when you have all this information you can just cross them off yeah guys so we've been able to create our facebook ads accounts for our business which is vip.close.com we've also been able to link our payments okay so when we run the ads facebook will take the payment from our visa card or if you have a paypal account you can link your paypal account um, so next on the list is we're going to learn how to create facebook ads but before that we'll have to create audiences so when you go to the all tools you come to the audience i'm going to show you how to and create um, a couple of targeted audiences so if you're selling your product yeah we'll have to um, create audiences that um, audiences that are most likely to purchase our products and that's what we'll be doing um, in our next tutorial so as i said in the part four we will learn how to create actual facebook ads but we'll start with creating or adding our targeted audiences okay my name is Kwame Chimisi if you want to contact me please contact me here and please also show some love and go and follow us on our Instagram page at fufufutv.com if today is the first time you're coming here and you find this tutorial useful please support me by subscribing clicking on that like button clicking on that share button so Facebook can promote this video to a lot of people my name is Kwame Chimisi I'll see you in the part four bye